Welcome, welcome back, everybody. For the astute observer, you will notice that we are not where we were before. This is the home system. Why is that, you might ask? Well, last night, I got a hankering. I got a hankering to mine. So, some things that are different. Uh, we're at Geology 50 because I mined for like an hour and a half straight. Uh, yep. Yep, and we're level 49. A level 49 gives us a magical perk, a magical skill called refineries have a 10% increased refining rate and 10 geology range. That helped us push over the edge to get one special amount of stuff. You will note that we have some iridium here. 26 Andorian components. Yes, it took an hour and a half to get the iridium to get this many Andorian components. One I got from killing a pirate. But, should we look at the Zeus? It is buildable. So without any further ado, smash the like button, hit the subscribe button if you are not already subscribed, and we are going to start the timer and build the Zeus. Let's go. It's done. This is the mighty Zeus building episode. That is what we're going to do this entire episode. And I'm just going to deposit all this stuff. And grab the Zeus. Uh, jump into it for the first time. Oh, I should sell it for 500,000. Right? Right? No. <laughs> Get in it. Oh, it feels so good. It feels so good to be in this monster. 27 people? How many guns does this thing have? Honestly, I didn't even look. I didn't even look. It's a Dreadnought. It's giant. Where's this gun layout? Oh my, what are these? Charges slowly for devastating outcome. Limited to one weapon installed. Range 50%. Heat generator minus 50. Charges for two seconds. Fires three with a 20 second cooldown. Okay. 200% projectile size and beam width. Consumes all flux. So it's got two, like, capital destroying weapons. I could put two Venki death rays in this thing. Oh my, look at these guns. What are these? These are just triple barrel guns. Um. Oh my, what? I don't even know. I don't even know where to start with this thing. This thing is just. Oh, it's nutty. Okay, well. <laughs> Actually, I do know exactly where to start. We're going to start with the Hades. And I'm going to swap back into that guy. And we're going to take all the weapons off. Are we going to take all the weapons off? I mean, maybe not. Okay, well, I'm going to take this off it. Yay. Well, you know what? We're going to unequip everything. We will rebuild the Hades later. When I can. So unequip that, and I'm going to also take all of the staff out of it. Alright, and then we're going to disembark everybody from the ship. So here is the, the crew, alright? Um, I should have renamed them with stats on them, but I'm a little dumb, so that was a mistake. Anyways, ship cargo, get out of here. Get into the Zeus. Swap into the Zeus. And then start putting things on it. So we know we need a heat sink. I'm I'm fairly. There's someone told me there's a hotkey for, for putting stuff on. Now I need to know. Settings, controls. <sighs> it's like shift something. Clear target. There are hidden hotkeys. Oh man, I don't remember. It's like equip, auto equip or something. This is just how to fly your plane. Assign controller, assigned controllers, none. So here's all your moves. Uh, there was going to be verticality to the game, but that was taken out. I don't have thrusters on because who cares? Aim vertical. Yeah. Verticality. Camera zooms. That's quest sector map. Clear target. Ah, okay. Well, well, fine. I'll do this the hard way. I will put on the heat sinks. I'm just assuming I need to. 
Um, also, a bunch of engines. There's an ancient relic and I can't get it. <laughs> I can't even move this thing. Uh, equip all the fusion reactors. Um, I got three miners reactors, which are 12. That's less than an ion. I think an ion's 15. And a fusion reactor. Sorry if these ancient relics flying around us are, are triggering you. They're triggering me too, but I, I just can't. This is 30 for three size. So two of them is 60. Uh, for six size, which is three of these is 45. So Venger reactors are actually pretty good. Wait, no, 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 no. Three of these is 30, 40, 54. Where is this 60? Okay, Vengi reactors are better. So this will this will act as our fifth reactor. Are they better than fusion reactors? Well, they're better than ion reactors, that's for sure. But are they better than fusion reactors? Yes. De okay, well, they're definitely better than these ones. I think they're better than fusions. Mining reactors are not. Um, and I will put on the two batteries. So that's good. Uh, we will put on... I think the capital... This one. I need as much thrust on this thing as possible. I don't know if I need more power, but I, I probably will. This thing's not going to go fast enough. Oh, another thing we got is... Da, 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 D.O. Sweeper Drive. So we're going to build you. I got a blueprint for it somewhere. So, yeah, we're just going to build it. Thanks for the D.O. Sweeper Drive. And we're going to upgrade you. Because this thing... So this thing acts as both the Optronic Drive, which we have... Um, and the atomic drive, I think, is seven size. Yeah, space seven. So space seven plus our sensor was space nine. This is space five. So it's actually going to save us some space. It won't give us as good stats as we had before, but once we upgrade it, that's still pretty good. Scanning power is 300. So when I go to the other scanner which is here, the Syndicate Scanner. See, it's 448, so it's much farther. But sensor power a little bit farther, loot detection not as far. But now for two extra space, we can jump and do all that stuff at the same time. Okay, what is next? So we have an engine. Great. We have a drive. We need a booster three. Well, I might need two booster threes, to be honest. Let's put two booster threes on it. I definitely will need these. This thing is heavy, so I might need a third. I'm going to put one in there anyway and see what happens. I will need gyroscopes. Uh, those ones are better than these ones. So we're that's, that's our life now. This one's 23 with ship mass. Being 3.2, the heavy armor for Vengi is better, but the Andorian armor gives you better hit rate, and this one makes us lighter. So you might actually do Terran armor on this guy, because why not? This will make us lighter, which will make us more faster, and this ship, it could zip. So if I compare it to the Vengi heavy, so it's much different. It's, uh,. Damage resistance is 56% already because this is a battleship. Yes, it is. Oh boy. Il Beto Shippo. Okay, we'll put on our heavy shields and I'll put on a ton of shield generators. All of them. Um, maybe the shield absorber as well, but it's not really required. Uh, definitely want the battle computer. 
the Trader Codex, the Debris Analyzer, all this stuff. Weapon Stabe, Loot Finder, the Dolo's Combat Mod, one of these bad boys. We already have cloaking devices. I need my flux cap. I need my flux accumulator. I need... Uh, I could put a collector on it. I mean, I'll do it for now. Also, we found that collector. The pirate protector is just better than the energy barrier. Cooldown 7 seconds. Impact damage absorber. Impact damage booster. I mean... Yeah, 3.5 seconds is just better. That's fine. Put on the spotlight again. We got heat sinks. Oh, the other thing that helped us get it was the PMC mobile refinery. We found one of those. Uh, that is it for main systems. Why is this in here? take off some of this garbage that I don't need okay so that's the build for now uh, now the hard part <laughs> figuring out who to use all right so I was running him just as an engineer and he's 15% energy gain how many engineers do we have two I think I was running you as a gunner Oh, weapon range. Maybe I was running him as like a co-pilot. Oh, uh, there's only one pilot in the ship. His pilot skills like just aren't that good. He's level 50, he's purple. But he leveled up like very slow. Gunner with excellent aim. I believe you are being assigned as a gunner. Congratulations. Um... This is... I don't even know when I got this guy. Mining speed, mining things, energy gen. Uh, weapon range, weapon damage. I have no idea when I got him. Excellent aim. Yeah, I like that. Uh, here's an energy... Uh, I have... Okay, well, we have Ziggy. Has a gunner or co-pilot? kind of want to make him a co-pilot. He just gives max speed. And I could put him in a gun with a peacemaker and the peacemaker can be like super explosive. Oh, you can do a flight test. Oh, yeah, not without not without staff. <laughs> Never mind. Hmm. Warp distance. Oh boy, this is going to take a while. How many supervisors we have? Two? Uh, whatever. Commander advancement rate. I mean, we're going to need that at some point. Um, I got some really good people. You're an expert tactician. Damage resistance, energy generation, and the hull points. Hanger repair bonus. Do we even have a hanger? We do. Corvette hanger. So I can get like a squad of Corvettes. Uh, I don't need mining speed. Navigator, warp distance, warp distance, scanner power. Yeah, you're pretty good as a... You're also pretty good as a pilot. You are also good as a pilot. Can I set nickname? Oh, no, I don't want to type your whole name in. You're just a speed pilot. Um, you are just a specialized gunner with good aim, so we will assign you as a gunner with good aim. You're an engineer. You're a gunner with decent aim. Good chance weapon heat. Tactician. Supervisor. That's probably what I want you to be. Although pilot. Acceleration and max speed. I had... It's like this guy or something. 
Uh, I think this guy was one of my engineers. But then I found a better one. A better version of him. Very good aim, and look at all the, the bonuses you put. Wow, this guy's amazing. Alright, well, into the gun seat you go, sir. Uh, what else we got? Very good aim, weapon range plus 43. Yeah, okay. You have good aim as well. Congratulations. You're a supervisor. Geology Global Trading Market Insight. Perfect. Sign a supervisor. Got one. Uh, speed booster plus 25% as a master pilot. I think that's the pilot I was using. Uh, you're global trading, but you're also very good aim. So I believe you're into the gunner seat. You're a supervisor. Congratulations. Welcome to our life as global trading bonus specialist. Aha! You are just good. Oh, can I make you first officer? I can. And you just give us everything. Engineers gain, tech acquisition rate, crew efficiency, geology, trading, mine metals, mining. We get all the bonuses. And then we get the engineer bonuses. Extra energy storage and stuff, which is pretty good. Expert in crew experience, receive crew efficiency. Instructor, so your staff. Yeah. You are decent aim at warp distance. Yeah, I think you're going to go as a gunner. Tactician, oh, that's spot right next to us. Master gunner. Congratulations. So, do we take... We're not going to take you as a pilot. I guess we take Bogan as a pilot. Acceleration, max speed, booster. Yeah. There you go. Congratulations. You're the pilot. And we're going to put you as an engineer. And I'm going to put in... You as another shooter. Oh, this is going to take a while, guys. Buckle up. This build is crazy. Mm, don't want him as a supervisor because he's going to lower my weapon damage by 30%, which is no good. I think Larry Brown will be the other engineer. Even though High Tinker has 15% energy gen, which is huge. But we're also 12% energy gen right now, so we're sitting pretty good. And I got one, uh, two, three damage resistance out of that, and a little bit of absorb, so that's fine. Ooh, what do we need? Navigators. Where be my navigator? Oh, this was the guy. Shield, energy storage, damage resistance, shield absorption. So just better than Miko. Bonus tech level one. I don't really know if that's going to help us. So Larry Brown, you are... You're diversified, diversified. Oh, he has T2 skills. Now, where was that guy? Uh, experience, base pilot, mining, tactician. So if I make you staff... Yeah, I can make you staff. Right, tactician to staff. Acceleration, fleet ships gain acceleration damage and stuff. This was the guy. So I'm gonna put you in as a second engineer. There you go. And now it's just gunners. Oh, navigators. I need to find a navigator. You, sir, are a good navigator. And I guess you too. You have Tactician, which will make my fleet ships better, which is pretty good. Ziggy's going to end up being a gunner, although if I made you a pilot and take that max speed, would your as gunner or pilot or co-pilot, if I make you pilot, will all the weapons gain for uh, whatever, we'll make you a gunner. Congratulations, Ziggs. Um, 
Navigator. Warp distance was 20%. Pretty good. And now I need some more gunners. You're a pilot and a pilot? I don't understand that. You're a supervisor. You're a supervisor. You're an instructor. Well, I mean... I don't know. Supervisor. You're a gunner. So congratulations. Man a gun. You're an engineer. Right. Okay. Gunners is what is required. Fleet ships gain HP regeneration per five seconds. Uh, yeah. That's going to come in handy. Welcome to the guns. Pilot. You cannot be a gunner. I could put you in a staff. But a lower crew efficiency. Assign a staff. Well, yep, that actually lowers it, so... Sorry, High Tinker. You... Cause problems. Acceleration minus four per second. So he slows things down as a <laughs> tactician too. Okay. Interesting. Pilot. You're a gunner. I mean, you can gun. It doesn't mean you're a good gunner. You want more staff. You have good aim compared to this guy. You also have good aim. Weapon range. Max heat, critical chance. Mm, bonus fleet commander. I guess I could put you in as staff for now. Oh, you're better. You're a much better staff. Yeah, let's put you in as staff. There you go. Get that damage resistance on our friendly ships. All right, are we full up? We are. Let's take the sucker for a test drive. Ooh, we are slow to speed up. But our turn rate's decent. Speed, not very fast. Even with Terran armor. Hmm, okay, well. That is something. How am I going to fix that problem? How do I fix that problem? How do I make this lighter or something? Well, first off, reactors. I need that. I need that power to be real high. All right. So second off, speed booster and nullifier. That's gonna help. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get it. Um, we're gonna turn on our light. Our light's on. Okay. Our light is on. Wait, what? We took these, didn't we? They just respawned? Okay. Um, we need to... I don't know what we need to do. Ship enhancements. Ship enhancements. Anything to make the ship... Well, damage resistance is probably huge. Oh, enduring components. Alright, that's not going to happen. Oh, man. This would be great. Just a passive regeneration of 1%. Okay, so I need some Andorian components. I don't want to fill all this up, but uh, I will take a weapon heat. Right? What do we have for weapon heat right now? 120 cooling. Oh boy, we can put some weapons in this thing. We might not We need weapon heat for the ship. 50% extra explosive. Haul. We're having damage plus 10. Amazing. Um, well, we could do like a shield. This this is a good one for now. Do one of those, and then I think we'll take, uh... I might take hull points. Oh, you know what? This will get us our actual speed. This will get us our actual speed. Going on a test drive. Go in as fast as we can. 62, and if I boost, 69. All right, nice. All right, we're not as zippy. We got a real slow start, but wow, this ship is giant. It is a big ship, and I am excited. 
All right, I don't need these. I'll keep you, I don't need you. Uh, okay, so I got, I got space. I got some space for some stuff. All right, so in the short term, I think uh, putting in more reactors is going to be helpful. So let's do two more large fusions. And we'll upgrade these to purple. Yeah, we got lots of stuff. That's a lot of power. 625. Amazing. Um, I don't have a way to make it lighter. So... I think we just start slapping on shield chargers. And uh, shield gens. We have 11,000 hit points. But shield gens... Wow. Okay. Let me just put on some shield gens. Uh, shield charger 15 for two space. Do I have the repair on it? I do. So repair I want is three. Uh, I forget what was two. Two was a shield, the pirate shield. Which is here. Oops, changed to two. Uh, collector beam I'll have on nine. Capacitor I'll have on eight. Weapon stave I'll have on seven. Okay, everything is there. Can this thing even... Can it even? It, uh... Can it actually despair? Eh, for a bit. For a bit. Okay. Okay. We'll just upgrade these. Yep. Yeah. And then, oh, you don't. we're on Ancient Relics now. Um, Collective Beam will upgrade too, because why not? This Heat Sink will upgrade too. How much space do we got? Uh, oh, we actually don't have this space. I might have to take out some chargers. Uh, yeah, because if we run a fleet, let me just quickly throw up a second ship. Um, add to fleet. Who can drive this thing? Someone who's got uh, gunning and piloting is required. Because if you can't gun, you're toast. Okay, well, none of these guys can pilot. Okay, great. Let me cancel that and see if I can find a gunner pilot somewhere. Gunner pilot. Pilot's gain efficiency. Uh, you got engineer. Pilot gunner. You have bad aim though. That's because you don't have expert. It'll go up over time. You have bad aim. That's not good. Well, if I give you all missiles, that's fine. So let's um, let's uh, add you to fleet with uh, Alice Armstrong. That's our actual size. That's our actual guns. Crew is still 27. Okay, so that's all fine. So we're actually good. That This is our, our real deal size. Um, and you are going to... You're already docked. How do I... How do I... Uh, refit. Wait. There's a way to pull the ship back and, like, refit it. Remove from fleet. There you go. Yeah. Alice Armstrong will be the driver, and that is the Archimedes vehicle. Okay. So, this is the max size we can actually run. 
um, which is fine. And I need one, two, I need six. Six, count them six. Impert kits. Yep, that worked out. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then the ancient relics are gonna get used to make this ship pop. So we are 345 shield charging. We're a monster. Now for the weapons. I don't even know what to put on these things. So I can't put peacemakers there, but I can put peacemakers here and triple peacemaker. Hmm. How's our turning speed? It's not bad. It's not bad. I want a lot. Um... Oh boy. Oh boy. What are we going to do? So I'm thinking lasers on the sides. Oh, the timer. I really love to build this. In the next episode, we're going to have to do... We're going to have to do this. Um, wow. It's like, I want PD lasers on the sides, but the PDs I have are just one size. And I have three here. So, do I make... No, I think I keep it as one size lasers. And then I stack... I don't even know. I don't even know. I'll see you in the next episode, folks. We're going to figure out lasers. If you have any suggestions, hit me up. Um... And maybe I'll make the changes in one of these episodes. Definitely want to put the missiles on, but these peacemakers don't fit in these guns, which is a perfect place for peacemakers. So all I can do is can I peacemaker here. Every 20 seconds, you're going to blast a peacemaker with extra damage, and it'll be even bigger. Projectile size up 200%. That'd be funny. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I don't know. I'll see you in the next one. Look for Doom Cannons in them, that'd be neat. Uh, Doom Cannons or Vengi Death Rays will fit in those. They won't shoot for long. Yeah, they definitely would not shoot for long, but those would be wildly dangerous. That would let me just destroy the Super Railgun? Does it extra damage? Range range so probably like PD and all these and then maybe I can, oh maybe I can two two flood guns here two flood guns triple barrel flood guns oh my god okay well I'll see you the next episode folks I can't keep I could do this for days I just keep thinking of new things to throw in there and, and do uh, is the Venki death ray stronger than the capital beam laser. It is indeed. But the heat's a problem. So I could put like two ultras in there. Cause it's a lot of damage. Or I could just make a six size laser and put those in there and just blast things to death. I don't know. These ones are gonna be the ones though. Probably. Cause these are charging weapons. I don't know. Bye.